are you the type to breathe like this or like this? Which one do you think is correct? So let's get straight to the point. The answer is in Shotokan. The breathing techniques might be a little different in Goju Ryu and the styles in Okinawa, but today I'll be focusing on Shotokan. The one rule that you should take away from today is when the technique is applied, you breathe out. And when the technique is pulled back, you breathe in. So let's learn how to do it step by step. So I'm going to take an example of a regular punch. So first, stand like this and pull back your punch. When you do this, like you heard, you breathe in and your stomach pops out just a little bit. And when you punch, you breathe in, out and you can see my stomach contracting you know coming closer to my body so if I do now pay attention to my stomach see if you breathe out like this it's very hard to use your stomach muscle but if you want to utilize your abs then it's better if you open up your mouth and breathe like this. Okay, you can try it out. Try out doing this. This, you tend to focus on your teeth and your mouth. So, you know, you only, you're only you only breathing using your um, throat and the muscle around here. But what you want to do is control the breath or control the air that's getting into your lungs and out with your abs. So, you can feel your muscles. So once you understand this mechanism, let's do it in a regular kihon. So this way. Make sure you're finished breathing at this last turn. Right? So please, please, this is a very important concept in kata and kumite as well. In kumite, why do you think people shout out at the end? That's because you want to breathe out when you make the kime. So, you know, it makes sense. If you have any other questions with breathing or anything else, then please comment down below and check out these two videos as well. And if you like the video, please subscribe to my channel. Um, I hope to see you guys next time.